<laughs> good day, good day. This is your friend Dan. Oh, how the hunk are you? Welcome to Roverland. Have I got an unboxing for you? Uh, I'm going to make this two part. We're going to do a quick unboxing, hopefully, and then uh, hopefully we'll do some store finds. But right now, let's get into the unboxing. Hopefully, you folks had a great week. Uh, Saturday morning, we just do some unboxing and have some fun. So, the first one here comes from uh, MD. That's um, Maryland, I believe. Yes, MD, Maryland. Uh, what is the name? Laurel. Laurel, Maryland. Yes, let's get this out and see what we've got. Got huge packaging. We got a box. We've got, uh, let's see, what do we got? Oh, yeah, awesome. Awesome. Hold on here. We got some massive taping going on. <laughs> massive taping going on. We could probably lower that camera down just a little bit so we can see what the what the HE double toothpick we're doing here, all right? Yeah, this is an eBay purchase. Got these two. I guess I didn't realize they were from the same guy. I just, just figured that out. All right, we've got the uh, first uh, with the five spokes, six pokes. Yes, the first. I don't think I have this one. I think they. I had it in the uh, different wheels. I'll have to check on that. And then this is the white one. Um, this is the regular profile tires. They're not the uh, low profile tires. But uh, first gen Matchbox Defender 110. Awesome, huh? All right, let's go into... Hey, what do I got here? This one... Uh, let me grab my envelope opener. Uh, Kentucky, Lexington, Kentucky. What in the world would I get in an envelope? Well, I'm sure you guys could kind of guess what I got. Um, let's see. Oh, nice little packaging. How did they do this here? Kind of excited about this one. I got a shirt that I, I, uh, want to put this on. Why am I not being able to, uh, do this? Unbelievable. See my steady hand here. All right, come on, come on! Holy cow, this is this bugger is not getting away. <laughs> All right, here it is. Ba bam! Check it out. Yes, Land Rover Special Vehicles. I've got a uh, this uh, patch. Yeah, I got a um, club jacket, uh, club shirt uh, from Mississippi Mayhem. So we'll be putting that on there. Yeah, support Land Rover. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Uh, let's do this one here, get this kind of out of the way here. This one comes from uh, PA. Uh, Dur Dur Dermor, Dermor PA. Now this is a box inside a bag, so we'll quickly dispense of this bag here, hopefully. That's a tight fit. All right. Well, hopefully you folks have uh, been uh, getting around and about, uh, easing up with the uh, weather and with the uh, pandemic. Hopefully you guys are getting out. I hope, I hope, I hope. All right, here's another one. Oh, it's a nice heavy one. Get rid of the box. I just throw the boxes on the ground. And then I got a big, huge mess to clean up afterwards these unboxing Saturdays. <laughs> It's crazy. The work is not done when the camera goes off. All right, we have got the beige. Get in focus here. Beige Sudoku. Yeah, awesome. This is nice. These are these are uh, big models. This is a left hooker. I don't know if you can see that in there. Uh, whoop. But uh, compared to the matchbox size, you know, these are... These are pretty big models, so I don't have too many of these, but I have some, and uh, this one was a pretty good price, and uh, looks like a little customized. I don't think Sunuko, uh, well, the NK is definitely a, <laughs> Nicholas, I'm going to go with Nicholas, why did you do that? But no, having fun with his toy, that's nothing wrong with that. All right, let's keep going, because I've got... Uh, more to do, and I think I lost the tag on this one. Where did I? I don't know where I lost the tag to this one. Anyway, it's from somewhere in the states. <laughs> oh, look at this little thing! 
Oh yeah, I know where this. Uh, I know what this is, but uh, I can't tell you where I got it from because uh, nice little package. Yeah, I like this a lot. This is kind of cool. Yeah, this is kind of cool. Uh, did I get this off of eBay? I don't think. Yeah, I did. I I get it off of eBay. Check it out. This is a heavy duty. Wow, very very cool keychain. Yes, if you are a series uh, owner or uh, have driven a series truck, you know that that is the uh, steering wheel uh, um, dash cluster. Yeah, that is awesome. Wow, cool. I, yeah, that is really neat. That is really neat. I love that. All right, let's uh, keep moving on. I'm sorry I lost the tag to that one. I don't know where, where that one went. It went in somewhere. Uh, next one, Olympia WA. That's uh, Washington WA. See what we got here. Here it is. Throw that box. Oh, thank you. Thank you, by the way. <laughs> Little note. Kind of cool. All right. What do we? Oh, hey, check it out. Very, very nice, clean. Um, now, is this the. Uh, Thailand. I think I'm trying to find the one that says China, I believe. Made in China, not made in Thailand. This is the second one. The first original green one uh, says China. This one, a uh, beautiful, beautiful example. Can't go wrong with that. Beautiful example. I don't know why my lighting is so kind of uh, obscured today. All right. Uh, what do we got here? We've got... Uh, Oh yeah, another uh, Laurel ND. Oh, I think this. Uh, yeah, I think I bought two, couple of things from this guy, two different times. Yeah, I think that's the same. Let me look. Bro. Yeah, this is the same guy. Uh, he had it must be selling out his collection or whatnot. I don't know. But uh, let's see what we got. Heavy on the tape again. Okay. Yeah, I remember this one. Yeah. All right, hopefully he's not getting out of Land Rovers altogether, just selling some of his quadruples, because you, uh, you can have doubles, that's okay, but <laughs> another, here we go, very beautiful. Um, this has got the um, Lily, Lily uh, spoke wheels, yes, which is kind of different. Normally they're the, the um, like five or six spoke wheels, but this is the Canyon Park, uh opposite of the uh green one uh yeah all right this next one is uh from our friend over there in uh uh where is it K uh kentucky no uh va virginia yes joseph Lowe. yeah he uh had some more stuff that he wanted to sell me and so he sold it to me now i can't get the box open i don't know where it goes all right here we go here we go. Yeah, so let's see. I can't, I kind of remember what I bought from him, but I don't remember what I bought from him. <laughs> so this was a um, longtime member of Roverland and uh, collector uh, uh, many different things. So let's just go in here and see what uh, I bought from him. Yeah. Okay, here is, uh, we're going to start out with the unique one here. This is a China bat knockoff, made in China knockoff. It kind of, the front end kind of looks like a Land Rover. So uh, I picked it up. He had it, and I'm like, yeah, okay, I'll take it. That's kind of unique. I'm I'm into the quirky toys like that. A quirky, not not corgi, quirky. Yes. <laughs> oh, here's the pride and joy that I wanted. Yes, uh, you know what? I do not have this version of the National Parks Forest Ranger with the white and black uh, ch um, striping on the bottom. I do not have this one. These cost a lots of money, and he was uh, kind enough to sell me his that he had. So really kind of cool. Here's another one. Here, here you go, another discovery. Uh, this one has got the, uh, as you can see, it's got the 50th anniversary uh, logo on the hood. And I'm going to show you it like this because uh, it's kind of hard. Yeah, 2002 Matchbox. 
uh, mint on the on the card <laughs> in the box. So this is gonna go up on the display. Uh, yeah, 2002. So very kind of cool. I I don't I didn't have this variation. I have this car, but not the one with the uh, decal on the front. So he is uh, really helping me um, with some uh, hard to find stuff. Uh, you know, he's always done that. Here's a cool little classic he found. And this is the Corgi. We're talking about Corky. This is the Corgi Land Rover Fire. Uh, I do have one of these, but I like to have it in the package. And he had it, and we were shipping stuff. And so I was buying stuff. So I went ahead and bought this one. Uh, I do not have uh, original uh, Corgi. Now, this is still taped and stuff like that. Uh, the, I think the Corgi I have is not original uh, in the box and so that was kind of cool to get that as well so there we go some really awesome stuff uh, as you notice I've been uh, not opening or uh, bringing this into the screen because this is a doozy right here uh, Montebello California is where this comes from and uh, this is going to be another pride and joy of my collection my two worlds have come together and I can't believe it uh, finally finally uh, if you guys follow me at all you know that I'm a huge huge Jurassic Park guy and a huge huge Jim Carrey guy yes but BAM yeah look at this are you kidding me Ace Ventura when nature calls yeah uh uh, oh, little chitty chitty bang bang, we love you. <laughs> yes, that by the way, in the movie, uh, when he sings that song going cutting across the jungle, uh, that was a whole improv uh move by uh Jim Carrey uh singing that song, <laughs> chitty chitty. <laughs> yes, I can't believe it. This is it. So, this is uh, this was kind of a big uh purchase for me. Uh, I'm going to tell you, what was it, uh, 26 bucks, which, um, come to find out, that was a pretty good steal. That, that was a deal. Um, so here it is. This is awesome. Now, this one is taped, so this is as far as we go uh, till I get another one. <laughs> but uh, Greenlight, I can't believe it. Yes, Greenlight Hollywood, the 1961 Land Rover uh 88 series 2 yes this baby is a beauty yes i don't normally spend uh 26 bucks on one model uh if you at all follow me at uh on this channel but uh when my two worlds come together uh <laughs> it is an awesome thing um yeah so hopefully they will do more of these uh when they get the rights green light when they get the rights for something, obviously, like any other company, they're going to milk it for all that it's worth. So hopefully we'll get some other ones, too. Um, this one and The Adventures of Tintin, the Land Rover, uh, those are uh, my two movie ones. That, And, of course, James Bond. Don't forget James Bond. But anyway, these are awesome. So there you go. Um, I'm sorry. We're on to 14 minutes. That's about the capability of my phone. Um, we're going to end on this, baby. I got to do uh, store fries. Uh, nothing big. Um, hold on a second. I'll just show you. I got like, yeah, Target finally came through, and I got like 10 of these babies. Yeah, awesome. That was one store find. Um, the other thing that I found was a couple of these. are just these two unbelievable walmart come on let's go uh i got one of these yeah that was cool three of these those were awesome finds oh here's what i really want to show you uh hobby lobby is doing the uh majorette 12.99 for this bugger but it's the deluxe model uh maybe if i have i have to check to see how many of these i have and if we can open one up yet i don't know but uh Hobby Lobby, there you go. Uh, that's it. Wow, I had to do you a quick show, st store finds there. And uh, yeah, so <laughs> look at that. 
All righty then. <laughs> this is your friend Dano. I'm out of here. Thank you for joining me. And remember, if you're driving through the jungle, slow traffic, keep right, and have a great rover day.